Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I'm back with a high-end kind of a look and um, thought I'd go ahead and share with you some of the high-end products that I love and I think are well worth it. And so as far as um, what I started off with, um, my base, I went ahead and used the Soul uh, Body Face and Body Bronzer and I mix that with the Pretty Fresh and uh, this is the one in uh, 2W and so I mix those two together to go ahead and get my base and then as far as uh, my bronzer goes I used the Filmstar Bronze and Glow and this is the one from Charlotte uh, Tilbury that you can find on Sephora and this is the mini size so that's the way that it looks. Really cute packaging. I've had a lot of great use out of this and I haven't even hit pan. Uh, the other Charlotte Tilbury one that I'm wearing um, actually is a highlighter but uh, at also it's an all over face glow. It's a Hollywood Superstar Glow Highlighter. I wasn't sure that I should get this and then once I got it I was like I'll never hit pan on it. Yeah. I like it. That's how much I've used it so far. I got it around the holidays. So, um, and again, really pretty packaging and uh, definitely well worth it in my opinion. As far as blush, I went ahead and used the Sigma Blush Palette. And uh, yeah, I think that's, it's called the Sigma Blush Cheek Palette. So uh, th this way the colors look in there. And I went ahead and used uh, this one, that shade right there, and that's Pinkin. And I used uh, the Flower Bronzer in Heat Wave as well. As far as my eye look today, um, I used the Pat McGrath. And this is, um, which one is this one? Rose Decadence. So this is a Rose Decadence palette and actually if you go onto her website you can find it there a lot of times it will be on sale and so um, I have this on my base uh, this on my inner corner this on my outer corner and then I have um, this just on the uh, outside of um, yeah the real inner corner and then this one I took all the way up to my eyebrow and then I put a little bit of this one um, actually right on my lid so that's what I have going on there and again it's a rose decadence it's really pretty palette really nice packaging cardboard and uh, definitely feels very luxe like it a lot um, I went ahead and used uh, the Oma and this is the It's Complicated shade. Um, and then I mixed it with the Ultra Glossy Lip from ColourPop. So these are the two colors that I have on my lip today. And I thought since I have this other Pat McGrath um, palette, this is one of the Sephora ones that you can get. And um, they tend to be, well, they're really cute. They just don't have the Lux packaging and they're very very um, pigmented. I think I'm going to go ahead and use this gold over here uh, right in the center of the eye. And it definitely shows up. So, yeah. Actually, I guess I'll blend those in together. Yeah, so it's got a totally different look from that. Um, so, as far as what the eyes look like, this is what they look like. And again, I went ahead and added in this gold um, from this Pat McGrath palette. These are available on Sephora, and uh, this one, the only place I've seen it is on her website. So, uh, that's what I have there. And, um, really fun uh yeah definitely definitely fun high-end kind of look and uh fun rosy kind of look 
and it's very blendable is how I would describe it. With all of these, they blend really nice, so you get a really blended look. So uh, that's what I have. Oh, a couple of other things. I always do that. Elf as far as the brows. Charlotte Tilbury as far as under the eye with her eye cream or eye powder. And I have the one fair. And then uh, the Sky High Mascara. And um, the Star Surfer. This one I have on as far as a highlighter. And uh, this is Star Surfer. It's from Kaleidos and um, their Space Age uh, Highlighter series. And that's what that one looks like. So uh, that's what I have on. That's the look. And definitely done at this point. So um, thank you and have a good day. Bye.